What's up guys, thanks for checking out the video. In this episode I'm going to be showing you the 3D printed limit carp that I designed in SelfCAD. Um, a little bit of backstory for this model. I designed it as an entry for the competition over at my mini factory. Um, the competition called for you had to design an object completely in SelfCAD and then print it out and uh, post photos of it. Um, so I did all of that and I actually came in second place. It was a lot of fun entering this contest and uh, actually documented my process along the way. So I'm going to be showing that later on in this video of how I sketched out the design and then put it into Photoshop, cleaned it up, brought it into SelfCAD to actually do all of the modeling of the pieces. And then I printed out the parts, removed all the support material and uh, pieced it together and then strung the strings. Um, and I got some comments on the My Mini Factory page like, hey, does this actually work? Like, this is such a cool idea. Like, does, do the strings actually work? And I'll play a little bit for you. Hopefully you can hear this. Um, so I'll have to check later on when I'm editing the video if I'll even be able to hear those strings plucking. But, um, yeah, I mean, it, it does work. I don't think you'll be able to play a full song on it because while I'm playing on these strings, plucking them up here, these, uh, I'm not sure the technical term for them, but I'll call them like the metal rods sticking out there. They, um, the knobs, the, uh, tuning adjustment knobs, they're, um, they come undone pretty easily. So the wires get loose and it doesn't sound quite in tune. So it's definitely not a professional harp by any means. I don't claim to <laughs> claim it to be a professional harp. This was me just making something for fun and uh, for the enjoyment of posting it online just to see if people would like it. Um, so I guess that leads me to, yeah, if you do like this, uh, like this video, give it a like, give it a subscribe to the channel. I'm starting to post all my DIY 3D printing projects on YouTube and uh, I'm posting tutorials and other kind of how-to videos. Um, and then also if you want to check out this model and print it for yourself, feel free to click the link down in the description. It's over on, it's going to link you to my My Mini Factory page and um, you can download it for yourself if you'd like. Um, so yeah, basically I'll get into it, you know, with these later videos or the later series of videos of how I sketched it all out and uh, how this video came to be.